Hello, in this video, I am going to show you how to install Homebrew on your Linux machine. It's actually called Linux Brew for Linux. So let me just let me just sort this out. It's, it's annoying me now. Okay, so that's all in line. So this so Homebrew, also known as Linux Brew, is a package manager. It allows you to install packages such as game libraries. It's really good for developers, but in general, it's really useful. The reason you would use a package manager and not install them yourself manually is one, you have to locate you know the necessary files, and there might be more than one. You might, you might depend on something, you would have to install them if it doesn't install itself. Two, the process for installing it will be slightly different for every little package that you install. Whereas with Homebrew, it's the one thing, it's a command, it's it's a terminal, it's almost like a terminal based app store and you provide one command and it downloads that particular package. To install it's really simple, you just go to, let's close this term, let me show you from scratch, go to brew.sh, scroll down, go to homebrew on Linux and Windows subsystem for Linux and copy this command, go to terminal, paste it, Click enter. This will download and install Linux Brew. It will most likely take longer, you know, to install on your computer than mine, simply because I've already installed it before. Whereas obviously you will not have installed it. Next, what you want to do is scroll down, copy each one of these commands. So copy this one, copy it in, and click enter, and copy this one and click enter but for the third one we don't want to do it yet because as you can see there's a little sort of little instruction here if you're running debian or ubuntu what you want to do is dot profile so this needs to change to dot profile as does this if you are running centos fedora fedora or red hat then you can leave it as default so i'm going to copy that open up sublime paste it in here and because I'm using Ubuntu I need dot profile so just make sure you have the right command depending on your OS and now if I paste it in I just need to copy that and there we go so now I'm just going to clear it if I do brew it allows us to use that command so if I just do brew to install something you do brew install now what you want to install so hello for example and this will download and install it i've already got it installed so you might get this for example and once it's done if you type in hello that's all the hello package does just a little simple one to show you what to do you can uninstall stuff by doing brew install then the actual thing that you're installing which will be hello you can get a list of everything that is installed by doing brew list and this shows everything that you've got installed and you can update stuff as well and even search for actually searching for packages i recommend going to the homebrew website going back to the home page scroll down you can search here if you want to but if you want to just like a list that you can scroll through go down to homebrew packages browse all formulae and there you go you've got everything right here You've got SFML here, you've got GLSW for, you know, game and OpenGL development. And you've got a bunch of other stuff as well. There's some really cool, you know, weather-based stuff as well. Ansi weather is pretty cool. I recommend highly checking that out as well. That's really all there is to installing Homebrew, also known as Linux Brew, on a Linux-based machine. If you have any questions, feel free to pop me a message. And as usual, I look forward to seeing you in the next video.